Let's take a closer look at an Intel G540 CPU. These parts can be quite a bit of work to get into. After removing the integrated heat spreader, the silicon chip can be removed from the fiberglass with lots of heat. However, we're not done yet. There's a lot of stuff preventing us from seeing the silicon structures like underfill and the top metal layers. Sanding the chip with sandpaper is one way to remove material, but it's a technique I haven't mastered yet. It's very easy to put uneven pressure while sanding, resulting in this. Essentially, the corners wear down faster than the center does. That being said, you do get a nice view of all the different layers. The Intel Celeron G540 is a dual-core CPU that has 504 million transistors on the 32 nanometer process node. Like I said before, I'm still working on perfecting this technique, but if you want to see someone who has perfected it, I would recommend checking out Fritz Chen's Fritz's Flickr page. If you're interested, I've included the link in the description of this video.